What's up guys, this is Heist. Today we are once again ripping off Tom Scott and we are playing Two of These People Are Lying. Because two of these people will be, lest I say idiots. <laughs> I think we filmed enough of these now with Eric to know that he is truly an idiot. I don't know if he is our permanent- An idiot among idiots. <laughs> yeah, an idiot among idiots. I don't know if he's the permanent fourth idiot. We might have to try another idiot on for size because, well, you know, a little thing. But joining me today, he owns objectively too many model trains, Leighton Moreland. I have no response to that. That is a factually correct statement. Yep. Yep. My fiance still does not know how much I have and I'm a little afraid to tell her. He owns objectively too few model trains, Brett Weevil. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see him grab the torch, ladies and gentlemen. That was surprising. <laughs> And together, the three of us make one whole idiot. Well, no. three. We, no, we don't. Three quarters I, of one. I'm idiot. one of the idiots. So uh, you're a quarter of an idiot. Two. Three. Out of four. Oh, okay. Yeah, three yeah. quarters one, of an idiot. Yes. Two, three. Right. Together, we make three quarters of one idiot. And we're always in search of a fourth. And as we mentioned, you know, he eats his broccoli. No! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're special. Anyways, so we're playing two of these people are lying, in which. These three gents have put down a railroad topic of some variety on one of these cards. And I need to figure out which of them is telling the truth and which of them isn't. They win points if they convince me of their lie, or they win points if they convince me of their truth, and I get points if I guess the true one. So today, our first one is going to be... Deadwood. Well, if you have Deadwood, it's a little bit hard to make it hard, but... <laughs> Mystery Citrus! <laughs> he successfully fended it off, the bastard. Damn it. He's gonna go pick There's it up. There's another go. one over there! <laughs> okay, well, while Leighton picks up the Citrus, Brett, Deadwood. Yes, it is a rotten tie. Fair. Eric, Deadwood. It is the part of a car buffer. Buffer? Buffer. It's a UK term. I was going to say, what country are we in, son? The UK. Or any other railroad that utilizes buffers. Sneak pod! <laughs> Very mystery situation. With hand, went towards arm. Yeah. It was worth a shot. Deadwood. Town in South Dakota, wherein <laughs> Sam Elliott once roamed the plains. It's not and the, the Deadwoods. <laughs> No, 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 seriously. Um, narrow gauge operate, uh, Deadwood Central Railroad, mm -hmm. narrow gauge operation, operating out of Deadwood, South Dakota, serving various assorted mining establishments. No Sam mining establishments. Mining, mining establishments. Mining consortiums, <laughs> you say. <laughs> what do you have at this mining establishment? <laughs> mining establishment. I say, do you have any gold? What's up? What's up? What's up? Perhaps you're, you're, a silver mine. You, you don't have enough? You want more? <laughs> or is this perhaps one of the mining establishments that has uranium for you're, bombs? No, it's my uranium. Oh. That's my uranium. Oh. Not uranium. Oh. My uranium? <laughs> Mr. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's all coming together. You've gotten it the worst. You've actually had to like duck and cover. <laughs> well, the hat I'm, was askew. I am splattered. <laughs> I am. You're exfoliated. <laughs> so we have rotten part of a tie. Just a rotten tie. Rotten tie. We have part of a buffer and we have a narrow gauge op out of South Dakota. Now because I am unfortunately formerly affiliated with a product that maybe perhaps uh, thought about putting equipment from the Deadwood Central into their video game, perhaps maybe with like this thing called a tech tree? Never heard of it. I know that Deadwood Central exists and I know South Dakota so Maybe, but plausible, plausible. But the one um, that leads me right away is uh, buffer. So it's the it's the beam before a buffer. It's the beam that supports the buffer. It's beam? part of the block structure of the the buffer. It's the beam that runs. So illustrate on the locomotive behind you what well, that you one mean. doesn't have a buffer though. It doesn't, but it has a thing where a buffer would mount. Uh, basically, it's not the end sill. No. I'm assuming it's an end sill by it's your description. In beam. a way, but it's runs. 
or, or Oh, or longitudinally so to absorb. Absorb the. Yeah. So it's like draft gear. Oh, it's not, like buffer draft it's gear. It's just the wooden support for the. It's not actually okay. draft Is gear, but it's but it's it's yeah. what prevents oh, okay. the end beam from going kabang when buffer. Oh, I see. Yes. When spicy oh, couplings see. happen because oh, we have spicy. buffers and we can play train spicy as seen in Dural Valley. Oh, I see. Because I see. that's that's what buffers mean, right? Kabang. I mean, why have couplers when you can hit stuff hard? <laughs> We're good. <laughs> We're, you're good. You're good. Send. Uh, trade. <laughs> Send. <laughs> um, okay. Dead tie. Is there anything more to it? Where did the term come from? I, it is a rotten tie. That's that's really just it. You go out, you change dead wood. That could absolutely be it. But it's not terribly it. interesting. It's not terribly but interesting or funny, but I missed the assignment when we were writing cards. Like, I don't know that it had to be funny. Oh, well, fair enough. It doesn't have to be funny. Well, it just helps clearly it isn't. <laughs> Layton, Deadwood Central, Narrow Gauge, South Dakota, anything more? Mining establishments, same Mining alley. establishments, sorry. sorry. More? No. You want some ore? <laughs> ore? <laughs> nope, nope, that's about it. <laughs> this is going to be a quick one, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> All right, Mark. What is it, Mac? Mac. Da -da 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 -da. Mac. Mac. I have no fucking idea. <laughs> <laughs> I love how some of these are, it's because we're all very compelling and so good. I feel like you stumped this stuff because we all suck. <laughs> very simple, but very true. Very simple, but very true. I feel like it would have been more than just Deadwood if it was the Deadwood Central. Yeah. Like, wouldn't it have been Deadwood Central? Can I make a confession that will put me out of the running? Well, you I, kind of already yeah, have. You have, <laughs> yeah. That's fair. I totally forgot that Deadwood Central was an actual railroad. <laughs> Just... You were thinking of the one. He's thing. outplayed us, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> he's lied so hard he's that he's lied to true. himself. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> it's truth Eric. Though. Yes, it was. Me. Hey, hey! I have I have a more hey. specific definition of it. Hold yeah, on. yeah. Give Hold us some. On. Give us some actual. I couldn't think truth. It, like, off the truth top, us. That was the, the main of it. Aside um, from you know my quick thing. Deadwood is a wood part of the car buffer block structure. Well, I'll be damned. Yeah. That's very exciting. Well, yeah. we're gonna need another card from Eric. Uh, Eric! You guys do that and uh, yeah. Are you out of cards? I am out of cards. Okay, okay dude. Do research wanna... something real quick. Research something real quick. Put something in. Somebody else put it. Uh, or you just make Eric lie. I don't know. Eric! I mean. Don't tell me what you do. It doesn't matter. Do you want to no. steal my card? <laughs> make make him research something. I okay. Guess. Yes. Yes. All right. We're throwing all the cards in. We're throwing all the cards in. Is that good or bad in this context? I don't know. All right. Well, so after the last round, Eric got a point because he convinced me of his truth, and I got a point for guessing the truth. Yes. So. And Leighton gets no points for lying to himself. <laughs> <laughs> Leighton does get no points for lying to himself. That was. Yeah, that was beautiful. So we've got all the cards. So there's more than three cards here. So we've got both. It's not of... all of the cards, but it is more than three to kind of mix it up a little well, bit. Well, if the series does well, make sure you keep your other topics to yourself and we'll, you know, use oh, them later. There's no limit to the amount of bullshit we can conceive of. <laughs> it's very true. You don't know how many books I have? God. No. <laughs> how do I am? I'm a little afraid. <laughs> they seem to be growing. All right, and the topic for the second on. game is Bakehead. Bakehead. Uh, no idea. I've, I've, no, this is well picked. Whoever came up with this. Are we done stalling now? <laughs> yeah. Are we done stalling? I don't I'm know, I have half a mind to pick Eric because he's sitting there like giggling like mad. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, I don't know, we'll go late. You get some Layton, Bakehead the other night? on you in a minute. What's Bakehead? Another term for thermite whale, or thermite whale welding. Um, no. <laughs> thermite whale welding? <laughs> the great white whale. What do they think of that? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> That's what a whale sounds like. No, yeah. um, just Is the... that underwater <laughs> welding only? Uh, yeah. Uh, okay. Terrifying. Anywho, uh, thermite welding. <laughs> out. Bam! Oh, 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 oh,
<laughs> Another term for a thermite rail joint once it's done, the head of the rail is totally baked. Okay. Baked. Okay. Man. Yeah. 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 Hey, man. <laughs> Love it's you, toasted. Fred. Yeah. Uh, you, Fred. Eric, bakehead. Uh, bake. <laughs> Bakehead was a term for locomotive fireman. The bakehead. Because he baked? <laughs> or he was no, baked. No, that, that there in the cab is the, that's a backhead, not bakehead, backhead. <laughs> backhead. The backhead. Brett. Yes. Bakehead. Early colliery. You want to say that in American terms? <laughs> uh, very early coal mine railway in the UK. The bakehead. Bakehead was the name of the place okay like, like beaching head so we've got whale welding <laughs> <laughs> together we join my whales today the two whales join together two whales join together with the dawn light what are the vows of a rail vows vows not a and i we know that <laughs> i promise never to roll on you Got a rail of a whale to tell you, lad. A rail of a whale or two. There's no more There's lines. There's no more lines ah! left. He's throwing the ball. We need to find all the limes. Somebody's gonna have to go back and get a shitload of limes. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. <clears throat> uh, the rail welding. Any anything more? It's, it's just that the head of the rail is baked. Yeah, because they have to like yeah. to get it prop. <laughs> To get a proper joint, you know, they you build like a little in. oven around it almost, and it stays glowing for a long time, and that effectively bakes it, and once it's fully baked, that's when they can, um, basically that's when the ceramic cradle they build around it. Um, I say, Garcon, I think I would like my rail medium well. Do you, do you see the big words he just used there? He hmm. just used some big civil words. He's Ooh. trying to scare me. What yeah. big civil words did he use? Ceramic cradle. Whoa. Hey man. hey man. Yeah, no, once it's fully, that's a, that's once a it's... ceramic refractory, no less. Points! Mm. Point. We're not playing citation no. either. Yeah. History okay. Citrus! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, once it's like fully done, it becomes really brittle and then you can just knock it off and you know when the you know it's fully baked. Okay. I know the process he has described to be true. Mm. I don't know if it's called a bakehead. I wouldn't be surprised if it's a civil adjacent thing and Leighton's a civil engineer, I'm a mechanical engineer and he's trying to pull a fast one on me. We're civil, we don't do anything very fast. If our things start moving fast, then we've seriously failed. Lord knows CDOT doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Government projects. Gotta love them. No. Um, Eric. Eric! Eric! Is there Eric. any more? Why, why a bakehead for the farming? It was just the name. They were always hot in the cab of the locomotive and their heads were always... Hot, I guess. Where's the term come from? The term is just kind of a derogatory term for the locomotive firemen, kind okay. of like a coal, like a coal head. They were also called big heads. Okay. Struck from the record, Brett. Why does it be struck from the record? I'm, I'm ruling him out. Oh, I'm right there. Oh, I thought you said harshly. I thought it was something you said something offensive. Oh no, no. Like you can't say coal head on you YouTube. You can't say, say coal, coal head. head. That's offensive to all the people that use coal that are made out of coal. <laughs> That's I'm our word. I can't myself. use that word. Bakehead. Yes. More details? Anything? The 18 early, early days of railroading, back when it was still technically a plateway rather than a railway. Bakehead Colliery in the north of England, in the, in Birmingham. The, oh, in the yeah, Birmingham yeah. was one of the first collieries to adopt a comprehensive rail system, not just back and forth, mill to mine, but going through different things. They had a switch. I think they had a singular switch. switch. I think Eric didn't have substantive details to give us more, and I know this has bit me before, but this one, you're giggling, and it felt like it was just a shot in the dark. Good try. Uh, and that'll feel really bad if it is his, but anyway, Leighton, I know the process you've described to be true, and then that is how it works, and it's the whole thing. I've seen civil engineering done, I know it's scary. It's terrifying. But I don't think it's called a bakehead. Maybe in some slang somewhere, but I don't, I think you just pulled it out of your butt. Ooh. I think it's the colliery. 
Womp womp. <laughs> I kind of wanted it to be after that tirade, but it wasn't. No. I'm sorry. It's a term for a locomotive fire. Are you f***ing me? Not even joking. Yeah. Yeah. It felt yeah. like a shot in the dark grasping at straws, Eric. <laughs> Bring your A game next time. Bring your <laughs> A game. Bring asshole. bigger straws. Stop winning. You see, Eric has usurped me a second to them. I don't think I get a point for that, though, do I? You do. You duped him. Oh, oh no, Brett gets a I point. That's him. right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I don't. I forget point. how the points work, and they forget how the points work on Tom Scott's channel, so I'm not perfect either. Mm. <laughs> so uh, all said and done, on these three series of. Who's been lying? Uh, the only person to actually win one is Eric. The rest of them have been three-way toys. Look at this me. is true. <laughs> wow. 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 And that's the end of the video. That's the end of the video. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye. 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 Uh.